So we are Brad and Tammy Harvey, working with Heart for Central Africa in Tanzania and Kenya. We live in Nairobi, Kenya, close to the university where Tammy's working on her PhD, and close to the airport for my travels. Tammy and I are practicing extreme social distancing at 8,500 miles apart. She got stuck in the U.S. when she went home to deal with a family issue, and now she is living in our home in Arkansas with two of her kids and four South Korean students who got displaced when the dormitories closed. That's seven people in a two-bedroom house. Fortunately, she was able to put a travel trailer in the backyard. She has continued submitting assignments and has two final papers due mid-April. Then she'll attend two weeks of seminar classes virtually the second half of April. That will be midnight to 8 a.m. for her in the U.S. It was safer for me to stay in Kenya than travel through hot zones as I'm high risk. I continue my usual work in my home office, communicating with my translation projects via email. Though my upcoming trips to the Netherlands and Tanzania have been postponed, we're excited that the Omara's New Testament is almost ready for the publisher. I'm communicating daily with Pioneer Bible Translator's typesetter to check the final formatting. I'm also preparing the book of Genesis in the Omara's language for a consultation later in the year, and I'm preparing to lead a consultation in Revelation for an SIL Wycliffe project. There's enough work to keep me busy for over a year if water, electricity, internet, and banking systems continue working. Thanks so much for your faithfulness and your willingness to continue lifting up in prayer the leadership and the various ministries during this crisis.